Now, following the volcanic eruption in November of last year, Bali, one of the top tourist destinations in the world, has been uh, desperately hoping for more foreign visitors to return. Uh, Cha Sang Mi travelled to Indonesia to check out the island for herself and father's report. Indonesia is made up of over 17,000 islands. One of its most well-known is Bali. Also referred to as Land of Gods, the popular tourist destination is located in the southern part of the Indonesian archipelago. In November last year, a cloud of ash shot up out of Mount Agung, causing panic on the island of Bali. Thousands of people nearby were evacuated from their homes, and some 400 flights were cancelled. But now, Bali is returning to normal. That's not that critical. You know, if you look at the, the map of Bali, if you look at the distance uh, from the mountain to the touristic area, actually the distance is 75 kilometers. So meteorology institution, they are very fully aware of it and equipped it with the advanced uh, technology to monitor. Just after the Chinese Lunar New Year, Indonesia's tourism ministry says the country saw its foreign visitor numbers recover from the almost 30 percent drop last December. Tourists from around the world are returning to the island, which is much more than just a honeymoon destination. As well as a stunning natural environment, Bali offers tourists a chance to experience Indonesian culture and participate in a wide range of activities. A veteran river guide says rafting through a jungle along Bali's longest river is an experience that will amaze visitors. I have seen visitors from Korea, the U.S., China and Australia and many others. It is safe here in Bali, so come and have your holiday here. I brought all nine members of my family here. I think Indonesia is great because everyone from my mother to my youngest son can enjoy this place. The sandy beach, of course, is a symbol of the island. And the unique taste of Luwa coffee is a must try. And there's much more to Indonesia than Bali. On the island of Java, some 500 kilometers from Indonesia's capital, Jakarta, is the historical city of Yogyakarta, a center of education with buildings and landmarks that date back to the Dutch colonial era. The 9th century Prambanan Temple is one of them. The UNESCO World Heritage Site is the largest Hindu temple site in Indonesia. And it is currently being restored to its original size of 240 temples. With the three main temples, Brahma, Siwa and Mishnu, the height of Siwa is 47 meters in height. Bali and Yogyakarta are just two places on the vast Indonesian archipelago. One thing for sure is that by seeing just these two places, it's clear that the country is worth a visit. Cha Sang Mi, Arirang News, Indonesia.